Hurricane. Let's get a check of your early morning, first morning weather with meteorologist Jim Sion. It's going to be a pretty nice new year. We're going to have a couple of showers. We may have a little bit of fog, but I think all told, today's going to be a pretty good day. However, get ready for rain because we have not one, but two chances to pick up over a half an inch of rain. Right now, WDSU first warning radar tracking a couple of showers. Very light showers, but they're representative of the rain that we're going to see today. Officially, our chance for rain is 30%. That means 70% of us are going to be dry. But there's a shower moving through Morgan City. Thibodeau, maybe in the next hour, you may get a passing shower. I think these rain showers are going to be light for this morning, getting a little bit heavier by late this morning and this afternoon. But visibility is something that we're concerned about because the ingredients are there for some patchy fog. As of right now, it doesn't look like visibility is reduced greatly by any stretch. So no fog out there to be concerned about now. It's cold on the North Shore, 38 in Bogalusa, 40 our current temperature in Hammond. Warmer as you go farther south, but it's probably jacket weather first thing this morning. Here's a live look at your current conditions at Lewis Armstrong International Airport. Visibility there at six miles with 50 degrees the temperature. Here comes a cold front. Not the strongest cold front we've ever seen, but it is going to produce a couple of showers for us today. Again, that chance for rain at 30%. Now behind the front, our mornings are going to get colder again Tuesday. But take a look at the computer models and you'll see that the rain that we expect today going to be very, very broken. And actually on the North Shore, I'd put your chance for rain at about 10 to 20%. Here's your afternoon, mainly dry except for along the coast. Now, if you're along the coast, your chance for rain is a little bit higher, but again, these showers for the most part are going to be on the lighter side. This afternoon, your high temperature is still in the low to mid 60s. Dinner time tonight, comfortable, temperatures in the mid 50s. And then tomorrow morning, okay, chilly again on the North Shore. Temperatures there in the mid th uh, 30s with temps in the low 40s in other locations. Now, Tuesday is going to be a transitioning day for us. It's still going to be good through the afternoon, but look what happens as we go to the evening hours and then overnight. That's when the rain is going to come in. Wednesday morning, it looks like we're going to have numerous showers, maybe an isolated thunderstorm in place, but by Wednesday afternoon, things start to improve. Now, there's another chance for rain in the forecast, and it looks like it's going to come Friday night. Here we are about 4 o'clock in the afternoon Friday. New Orleans dry, but Friday night through Saturday morning, another chance for showers. I think we could pick up an inch of rain on that to, with that rain on Wednesday and then maybe a half an inch with the rain Friday night into early Saturday. So patchy fog today, partly cloudy with just isolated showers. North Shore, your chance for rain 10 to 20 percent, 30 percent elsewhere. Mostly clear and still cool tonight. You're going to be in the 30s on the North Shore and it's also going to be a little bit breezy. Then tomorrow, mostly sunny and cool, but very comfortable. Your high temperature about six to seven degrees below average. Late Tuesday to Wednesday, there's that real good chance for rain. And then Friday night into Saturday, a 70% chance for showers before we get cooler and dry on Sunday. That's a look at your WDSU first warning forecast.